them hype boys are back as the Goma Wrestling Heroes. No, not the hype boys. I'm talking about the hype bros and not an actual WWE, but in figure form. This is the WWE Fan Central. First time that we're seeing the final product on Mojo Rally. And what's he doing? <laughs> Zack Ryder's enjoying it, though. Looks like whatever kind of dance they're doing. Hey, I want to join this dance, man. Call me over, invite Hero Figs over to the house of the figgy, because these are the figgy lifers. When you say, like, WWE figures, whether it's retros, current, these three, well, these two, just Zack Ryder and Kurt Hawkins. But Mojo Rally, he came to join the party. Looks like we're getting some added accessories with him. We are getting the Andre the Giant Memorial. We've seen this with Cesaro, as well as the Big Show. But now we're getting it with Mojo. I mean, he did win it. So it's right that they're throwing that in there. And they're also throwing in the Stay Hyped shirt. Yes, <laughs> I'm hyped. Not necessarily for this figure. I think definitely Akira Tozawa. Another figure that's going to be part of this line. The other two, I think it's Carmella and the fourth one. Someone drop it in the comments. Oh, that's right. Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan from the, what is it, NXT run. Akira Tozawa. Yeah, we've only seen him once in the line. We've seen him in the basic, but we have never seen him in the elite. Really excited to get, finally get my hands on this. Again, you know, the basic was great, but I think what it all boils down to, the elite, it's just better in every aspect. I mean, not just because it's getting the added articulation, but they did throw in the tightest worldwide. <laughs> yeah, in the attire too. Do you remember your basic? It was just like a bland grayish silver. You're getting a lot of bright colors, getting a highlighter green, a nice bright blue shirt, and the shirt just brings it all together with the squad. Scan, uh, look, I know it's the same reused head scan from the basic, but how they printed on with the true FX, wicked, dude. Really, really love this. Now, I think the Daniel Bryan, though, I want to see that one more time. We have seen like side images, but I want to see the full frontal view because that's the other one in the set as well as what was it uh someone drop it in the comments carmelo carmelo is the last one in the set right here um right here the jeff hardy and edge from the wrestlemania 35 the, uh, these ones are up for pre-order at ringside collectibles discount code hero will save you 10 percent. this is actually the only ones that we haven't seen yet we saw shinsuke and aj styles we saw rollins in the mist but if you didn't again go on the channel we always keeping you posted on all this stuff for jeff hardy i gotta point this out you guys i'm not sure how i feel about how the hair piece is sitting on there it's just it's looking strange to me like i do like the facial expression how they captured jeff but just how the hair piece is on there jeff or sorry edge I think it's almost identical to the one that we had gotten in the SummerSlam Elite Wave for the, you know, like the style of head scan. Of course, the entire, it is different. This is, you know, a much earlier, you know, I, some, someone's going to have to let me know. I feel like Ed should also have that tattoo, or did he get that later on? I can't recall. I'm going to have to go back to the WWE Network and check out that Attitude Era. And this is what I mean by the hairpiece. If you look right here on, on Jeff Hardy, on the back right there, it just has a really, really wide gap on the right side. So, again, once we get it up and reviewed, we'll be able to find out a little bit more if these figures are worth the pickup. Now, really good news. I know some of you guys have been looking for these. These are starting to hit shelves. This is the second wave of the Flashback Elites. These are Walmart exclusives, which is Stone Cold. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, as well as Harley Race and Jake the Snake Roberts. Once you bring it all together, you get that Commissioner Michaels to put together. Cannot wait to find this, you guys. When I do, again, we'll get that review up, and we'll let you know what's going on with this Elite. Also, the Halloween sale right now, it is going on at Ringside Collectibles. Huge savings, dude. I'm talking about, like, Elite's under 10 bucks. And since we are talking about this, so for some of you that may have missed out on this, because when I did review... What was it? Uh, Elite Series 63. A lot of you had requested how do you get Shelton Benjamin in the gold standard attire. He is now back up on the site. So it's not like, oh, wait, am I going to get the gold standard or am I going to get the current? You can actually choose when you go on the site. So if you do want the variant, he is on there as well as the rest of the full set. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel. And we'll see you on the next one.